Greetings, dear viewers. I'm Coil Quickcard, and welcome back to Metroid Prime. I am actively losing my voice. So today might be a shorter episode than usual, but that should be okay because I have a specific goal in mind, and <clears throat> for the most part, I really just need to uh, travel in a straight line, pretty much. Magmora Caverns is uh, going to be our destination for adventure today. And I am going to be picking up all, uh, all that I can get here. Okay. There's not honestly much left to do here in Magmore Caverns. Uh, but I just wanted to be thorough. My missile max at this point is apparently 185. Uh, which, unfortunately, I think means that I'm actually missing exactly one missile power-up off of my list, which really makes me sad. Um... So, presumptively, somewhere in uh, this room, yes, okay, invisible platforms, there we go, is there another invisible platform, there is and this one's dropping, okay. And another. Oh, did you see that? That is one missile. So, next we need to head to the monitor station. Believe it or not, the next two things are, um, very, very adjacent to each other. So, that's gonna work out. And our final destination for today's episode is going to be getting the, uh, fire weapon. At that point, I will have unlocked everything except for the last power-up in the game. Uh, but I will be able to unlock almost 100% of everything left after I get that fire beam. So that is the goal for today. And honestly, I'm probably not going to do much more than that. Uh, actually, since this will run so short, I may record grabbing all the artifacts separately. And then just splice those two videos together and make it into a single whole. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do, because I already know this is going to run short. Well, good. Now I don't have to worry. Okay. So, the next destination... is right in here, in the Warrior Shrine. So, if you remember, when we scanned this long ago, it said that this was Bendizia. Well, we know what we do with Bendizia. And, boom. That is a Power Bomb expansion. And then the next one is super easy. 
because... Yeah, I think it's just through this door. This room, which we've seen several times, is also made of Bendesium. And this has, whoop, our next type of super missile. This is the super missile upgrade for the ice beam, the ice spreader. It is a single shot and requires 10 missiles to be used. This one is actually Oh my god. Am I seriously this uncoordinated when I'm sick? Uh, okay. We're heading to the geothermal core. I need an enemy I can use this on. It's not something you want to be using a lot, but it definitely has its hook. Well, there we go! There's an enemy that looks like it wants to get hit with an ice spreader. It also makes a really nice effect. Namely that. Thank you. Almost there. Dude, I do not have time for you right now. Well, I mean, I have the time, but... If I'm gonna lose my voice, I'd rather... get the recording done now so I can spend the rest of my, uh... the next two or three days while I have little voice. Just going around and collecting, uh, all the extra power-ups and stuff. I'll only need tiny snippets of voice when I, uh, collect key things, so I think this is a good plan. Come on, Grapple Beam. Don't care. Come on, Grapple Beam. <clears throat> Grapple Beam. Thank you. go. Alright, we have reached the geothermal core. Now, what the hell do I do here? Um... Rotating with platforms are in working order. Okay. So... How do I rotate them? What what is it I am supposed to do here? Oh! Grapple! That would explain it. Okay. So if these rotate, then I'm assuming... Yup, that looks about right. It's working. It's working! I am so close. I am so very, very close. Ugh. I can do this. Ugh. Not to mention that if my math is right and I'm missing exactly one missile power up, God, it'll probably take me two or three days just to find wherever the hell that is. Oh, okay, spider track. Here we go! No, 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 no! 
Oh my god. Okay. Let's try again. Oh, that is... That was very disappointing. No! Oh. Oh my god. No. Uh, okay. There we go. Okay. We're good. We're good. So, ah, up here. And that's a morph ball slot. Oh my. You know, I actually kind of thought I was done. It would appear that I was mistaken. So all I have to do now is do a perfect spider track puzzle while avoiding parasites, because I can already hear the parasites. Nope. Nope. There we go. I want all of the parasites dead. Oh, I hated that. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Oh my god, I super hate this. Oh my god, I super hate this. Oh god, please don't knock me off, you little asshole. You are just a jerk who's trying to make me so Oh wait. Yeah, what the hell was I thinking? Screw running around and worrying about very specific bomb placement. Looks like we can just skip a level here, skip a level there. Okay. I see. Nope! I got power bombs and I'm gonna use them. And up. Oh my god. I think that was it. I think that was it. I have finally found the plasma beam. Oh, thank God! The last beam weapon. The plasma beam is extremely powerful. And it's pretty rapid fire as well. And just because if I don't show you right now, I legitimately might forget before the next time I record... I want to show you something cool with the X-Ray Visor. So, you can actually see uh, Samus's hand inside of her gun arm. And, I don't know, I just always thought that that was a really cool thing. Anyway, I better go find a save point. Please don't populate this room with enemies. Um, save points right over here. Oh, thank God. I have so much 
work to do. Finding the last, you know, struggling power-ups and whatnot. I mean, it's not an unreasonable amount of work. It's just... Realistically, it's probably going to take me more than a full hour. And... Oh, you ass. I do have some suspicions um, about my missing uh, missile upgrade. So, I'm not a hundred percent blind there. I do have like a general idea of which areas, which missile expansions I'm most likely to have missed. So, uh, yeah, I will see you in a second as I grab the remaining artifacts and, uh, yeah. Welcome to the Edge of Fendrana. And a fitting name, because God knows it's about as far away from the main entrance as you can get. Now, this, you will notice, is interesting. There are no other marked doors on this map. However, there is a door behind an unscannable wall. And a red door and the reveal of the next Chozo artifact. The Artifact of Spirit, the 11th of 12. I am only missing three more, and two of those are here in Fendrana. Here we are at the control tower atop the space pirate base. We've known that there's been something hiding back here for a long time. And now, we can finally melt the window and go through it. Or, is that not how it's done? Oh, how do I? Uh. Okay. Dude. Do I just do this? There we go. The Space Pirate Control Tower has been toppled. And that means a Chozo artifact. The artifact of Elder, the third of 12. Three artifacts remain. Oh, uh, also I desperately need to get some health. So, yeah. I should work on that. And welcome to the Chozo Ice Temple, back on the other side of Fendrana. When we played this before, it didn't quite uh, want to let me through here. No? Okay. The scan said the water comes from the mouth, so... Ah, there we go. Just had to melt it at the source. Uh, 
Excuse me. There we go. I am so close. So very, very close now. Chozo Artifact Acquired. The Artifact of Sun. The Ninth of Twelve. Only two more artifacts remain. And in fact, there are only three things left in this game that I have to get that are not down in the phase on mines. Here in the Hall of Elders, the most sacred place for the Chozo. One switch remains. I appear to have missed it. There we go, that's more like it. <coughs> and this time, the entire statue moves revealing an unmarked door. And within this final chamber, a Chozo artifact, the artifact of world, the tenth of twelve and the second to last. All that remains now is the final artifact which will not be accessible until after I get my final upgrade. It is time once more to travel back into the depths of the Phazon Mines to uncover what is waiting. It's almost over, my dear viewers, and I will see you all on the next one. Now, how the hell do I get there?